The Ivy House Ultra Dressing 730 Series is available in three sizes for the hand, small, medium, and large, and one size fits all for the arm. Secure your IV site according to your hospital's policies and procedures. Following IV insertion, tape the loop of tubing small enough so that it will fit inside the inner curve of the dome. Protect the loop of tubing and catheter hub with the plastic dome. Wrap comfortably, leaving enough stretch to fit a finger under the fabric. Cut off excess fabric. Remove the blue release paper to expose a strip of soft surgical tape that keeps the device from sliding. Rewrap fabric, gently pressing the tape into place. Close with Velcro. A piece of tape on the fabric may be used for a more secure closure. Fold back the end of the tape to create a tab. Later, this will make finding and lifting the tape easy. Inspect the IV site by releasing the Velcro tab, lifting the dome, and viewing the entire site. The IV House Ultra Dressing 730 series can be applied to any IV site on either hand or arm. To determine whether to use a small, medium, or large size IV House Ultra Dressing, Simply place the patient's hand on the left margin of the size chart and measure from the proximal interphalangeal joint of the first and fourth finger, knuckle to knuckle. This will indicate the correct size. Following IV insertion, tape the loop of tubing small enough so that it will fit inside the inner curve of the dome. The IV House Ultra Dressing works for either hand, but it's the placement of the thumb that determines a left or right hand fit. For the right hand, slip thumb through hole closest to the dome. And for the left hand, slip thumb through the hole farthest from the dome. Position IV House Ultra Dressing over the loop tubing and catheter hub. Round edge of dome towards fingertips. Wrap fabric around palm, securing with Velcro. For confused patients, a piece of tape may be used to secure the Velcro closure. Fold back the end of the tape to create a tab. Later, this will make finding and lifting the tape easy. Release Velcro tab to inspect IV site according to your nursing practice guidelines. For the extra wide hand, the nurse may choose to use the 730 arm size IV house ultra dressing. Secure your IV site according to your hospital's policies and procedures. Following IV insertion, tape the loop of tubing small enough so that it will fit inside the inner curve of the dome. Protect the loop of tubing and catheter hub with the plastic dome. Wrap comfortably, leaving enough stretch to fit a finger under the fabric. Cut off excess fabric. Remove the blue release paper to expose a strip of soft surgical tape that keeps the device from sliding. Rewrap fabric, gently pressing the tape into place. Close with Velcro. A piece of tape on the fabric may be used for a more secure closure. Fold back the end of the tape to create a tab. Later, this will make finding and lifting the tape easy. Inspect the IV site by releasing the Velcro tab, lifting the dome, and viewing the entire site. From emergency department admission to hospital discharge, IV House products extend dwell time of the IV, reduce complications and costs. Properly protected IV sites will help eliminate unscheduled IV restarts and multiple IV attempts. Care and maintenance of IV sites is essential. IV House products are designed to provide instantaneous access to IV sites 
so nursing assessment can take place immediately. Early detection and intervention of IV site malfunction is essential to eliminating serious injuries. Change the IV house ultra dressing each time a new IV is inserted. Removal of the device does not harm skin or pull hair. All IV house devices comply with CDC guidelines and the 2011 Infusion Nursing Standards of Practice.